We did this activity with our students to make them more familiar with actions and movements and also to work through observations. These actions were something which were familiar to them, which they can relate to and now they have to put their observations into practice. So this is one way of looking at it. Another is that in future when we will be in physical space, we will be working with improvisations, playmaking. So these are all multitasking processes where you have to work on your character, emotions, location, what is the objective of your character and all these things. And along with it, you will be definitely need to do certain movements, certain actions or mime certain things which maybe cannot be brought on to stage or uh, are not present. So there, at that moment, for the audience to understand what exactly are you trying to do, you have to be very precise in your movements and actions. And there, definitely, we will be needing this technique called mime. We will be doing more such activities in future to be more in practice and to learn this technique even better and use this in future in different capacity. Thank you.